So uh, we're talking about density, and as we measure density, it's just the amount of stuff kind of crammed into one place. And by technical definition, you see this little uh, graduated cylinder that's mm -hmm. here? It's the weight of, uh, for example, the density of water is the weight of one gram uh, or the weight of one milliliter of water. Hardly that weight's a gram. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, so the density of water being one, that's really, really important for us to know. We have to pick things that are either more dense or less dense. So I picked a couple things for you. First of all, household Cairo syrup. Um, the light stuff uh, seems to work pretty well, and you can color it nicely. So I colored this one blue for you. Oh. So go ahead and fill up the, the container here okay, about a quarter, full, maybe a third full, okay. and keep it off the edges. Perfect. Oh, sorry, yeah, keep it off no, the edges. No, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> perfect. Oh, that's perfect. Right there. That's right. great. Yeah. Oh, shoot. I did no, not you did. It's perfect. It off you the, can, and now we need white because we want to do red, white, and blue. Okay. So I just took water and added some of this coffee mate to it. So that oh, is just going to slowly I mean, kind of pour very, it in there and okay. see what happens there. So you might get a little right. bit there. So a nice little slow. Yeah, there you go. Look Keep on going. Keep on separation. going. Looking I might even succeed in washing the side of the glass. You are doing great. So there's a red, there's a white, and a blue. And of course, the red has to sit on top of that. So you can go just a little bit more. Perfect. All, uh -huh. right? All right. Now the red is lamp oil. This is what lamp oil looks like. So oh, sure. if you have a concern, you're not going to give the kids yep. just lamp oil. Have some of those lamps with the wicks in them and you put yep, lamp exactly. oil in. Exactly. So, so there's your lamp, lamp oil. oil. So red. now just do your lamp oil right there. You ready? Right, so slowly. Lamp oil right there. Good job. Right down the middle yep, of it. Right down, right on the top. It's perfect. Is that oh, fun? Look at so that. look at how it's just oh, going to sit there and it's going to layer. So that Cairo syrup seems to be part of the magic there. So you can layer that in there. And so now you get a clear red, white, and blue. Look and three that. are not hard. I mean, it's pretty easy to do three. And three. So three is child's is play if I can do it. Seven. Yes. All right. Seven. So take a look at this. On the very, very bottom of this one here, we started honey. All right. Honey. So honey, and I had to do it kind of slowly. So Cairo syrup is the next thing. Okay. And then we have some Dawn dish soap. So there's, the, and now we're going to try to just layer in some water. So you slowly have to try to pour the water in here and so that kind of goes in and you get a layer of the water now you want to go as slow as you can so you can see for TV we're going to go just a little bit faster sure. but we're going to try to get that in there and then our final layers so oil will sit on top of that and that's kind of where you wrap the whole thing up normally and most people would wrap up oil at that point but not um, us but of course not because why would we just do that right <laughs> why would we do that so we need a little bit of oil that will go for the next one and that one will be a little bit easier so here's this here's a little bit of that oil so we'll see if the oil kind of sits in there so again the object of course is about seven layers. If you oh, can do four. seven layers, Safe. that's a pretty amazing thing. So there's that piece. And you can see the final one. So we're going to do, believe it or not, next is going to be rubbing alcohol. So you can push rubbing alcohol and set it on the top. And you can color rubbing alcohol. So you can see our water in there. And now we're just going to use the rubbing alcohol. And I made this purple. So a little bit of food coloring yep. will give us this. And So, so rubbing alcohol is super, super light or, or not as dense. Not as, as dense, not right? As not dense. as dense. Uh, so not as dense as the vegetable oil. So kind of see what that is there. This is and that's just layers cool. out. And if you move the final little column slowly into place, you can kind of see what this whole thing is going to look like. I should, can I, I should you move can move it. it. No, it's okay. You can move it. Just, I'm, I'm scared yeah. to death. No, that's okay. You can just move that last one there. Right, you can see why it's a way. slow process, but I'm eventually it starts over. to layer out there. It looks pretty good. And take a look at what happens when you really um, you move it in place. And we put a little bit of uh, that paper behind it. You get a chance to see what that okay, looks like. That and, Are you ready uh, for this? Oh, look at this. Oh, this is, and then nice. what happens is it'll graduate up, but look at the finished cylinder, and nice? I'll put this paper behind it. So as I was see, by. see oh, there's our seven uh, layers there right there. Dun, da, da, da. Look at that. I mean, so we go from red, white, is. and blue to all of that. So Cairo syrup, of course, being extremely dense, and our lamp oil on the top not being not as dense at all. So we get all seven layers sitting there and uh, water sitting in the very middle. That, that kind is of fun? just the coolest experiment. That is so much fun. fun. He was being so careful, very gingerly Ginger. putting each liquid in, and then they all, they'll kind of at rest, they'll separate out and look beautiful like this. So. Yeah.